everyone, my name is Elizabeth and I'm a UPK K-1 teacher at the Boys and Girls Club of Dorchese. And today with me I have my nephew, Damien. And today we're going to be doing a building blocks activity called As Long As My Arm. The materials you'll need to do this activity at home is a piece of ribbon or shoelace or string. But if you don't have any of these three items, you can just use your arm. You're going to be needing to record your data, so you'll need a piece of paper, something to write with, and a pair of scissors. The first step to making the graph is to fold it into thirds. After you fold it into thirds, you're gonna use your writing tool to write longer than my arm, shorter than my arm, and the same length as my arm. Just like this. Now we're going to grab what you chose to measure with. I chose a piece of ribbon, so we're going to measure, use this to measure Damien's arm. So he's going to extend his arm. You're going to start at his shoulder and you're going to lay it all the way across to the end of his fingertip. Then you're going to safely get a pair of scissors and cut it. So now that we have a piece of ribbon that's the same length of my arm, we're going to grab some household items and measure them to see if they're longer, shorter, or the same length as my arm. So now we're going to be measuring our household items. The first item is a shoebox. I think this might be longer than your arm, Damien. I think it might be shorter. Let's find out with our ribbon. And... It looks like it's shorter. Shorter? So now we're gonna grab our shoe box. Now on to our next item. The next item is a pillow. Do you think it'll be longer or shorter? Shorter. I think shorter too. So we're gonna place our ribbon down. Match it. And it definitely looks shorter. Shorter. We're gonna wrap it. So so far we have how many things in the shorter than my arm column? Two, Two. items that are shorter than my arm. Shoe box and a pillow. Next item. Is an umbrella. Do you think it'd be longer, shorter, or the same length as my arm? The umbrella's pretty long, so I think it might be longer. I think the same length. So okay. let's find out. So, so you are right. It's way longer than my arm. Yes. So let's graph it down. Moving on to the last item. The last item is a chessboard. Do you think it'll be longer, shorter, or the same length as my arm? Longer. I think it will be the same length. Okay. Let's find out. And it looks like it is the same length as my wow. arm. Wow. So now I'm going to wrap it. Now we have all four items listed on our graph. Now let's talk about it. Let's go over the chart that we recorded. And on this first column, it says, longer than my arm, we have an umbrella. What did you notice about things that were longer than your arm? I noticed that the ribbon was shorter than the umbrella. Okay. All right, now let's go into the shorter than my arm column. We wrote down shoebox and pillow. How do you know when something was shorter? What did you notice? I noticed that the ribbon was longer than the item that we measured. And the same length as my arm, which was a chessboard. 
What did you notice about things that were the same length as yarn? I noticed that they both had the same length as each other. Yep, so the ribbon and the chessboard was the same length. That's right. So you can do this at home as well. You can play as long as my arm, which is using your arm if you don't have the materials, and you can go measuring around different things around the house, like picture the frames, refrigerators, sofas, tables, or the items that we used as well. I hope you guys enjoy. Bye.